New at five, a man left with a broken heart and bruises following what he calls a random attack. The man says it happened while he was walking his dog and now his beloved pet is gone. CBS 4's Joan Murray is live in Wilton Manors with the latest on the search. Joan? Yeah, it happened right here in Northeast 6th Avenue in Wilton Manors early in the morning before, before sun up. This man was just merely walking his dog when he says he was jumped and now he is desperate to find his pet. He's an eight-year-old Manchester Terrier mix. He's skittish. Petey is missing, and his distraught owner not only lost him, but his sense of security. Nothing was said to me. Nothing was taken from me. I was just beaten, and now my dog's gone. Petey's owner is still too terrified to show his face. He says he was walking Petey as usual five in the morning, Northeast Sixth Avenue, Wilton Manors. That's when he says he felt someone following him on foot. Then a car stopped and at least two more men got out and jumped him. I couldn't see faces. It was dark and they took me to the ground pretty quickly and started beating me and hitting me in the head. And kicking me. The victim, a well known established businessman, has a swollen lip, cut on his head, and scrapes on his arms and legs. He doesn't know who targeted him or why. I was armed with only my flashlight and PD on my right hand. Um, and as soon as they took me to the ground, the leash was out of my hand. He was screaming out of his lungs. Like, I thought he got beat up. That's the first thing I thought. Please, somebody help me. My dog, my dog. They took my dog. Rick LaGiudice lives across the street from where the attack happened and called 911. He looked like he was crying. He looked sad. He was, you know, I would too. I mean, when I lost my dog, I knew what it's like. Someone said they saw a black dog running south on Wilton Drive. The victim and his partner are blasting social media with pictures of Petey and posting flyers all around Wilton Manors. They just want Petey back home. He's a nervous dog. We want him back, please. He still had his black leash on a choke chain collar with tags, identifying tags, and he is chipped as well. So here's another look at Petey. This dog is still missing. If you know anything about this case, give Crime Stoppers a call, 954-493-TIPS. In Wilton Manors tonight, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.